The suspicious death of four Hawaiian monk seals has triggered numerous calls to a tip line hoping to lead investigators to who may be responsible. It is a federal offense to kill them. Tonight, KITV4's Catherine Cruz takes us to Molokai for a closer look at the issue and what's behind the friction between the fishermen and the seals. There are only about 1,100 monk seals left in the Hawaiian Islands. Their dwindling numbers are why federal agencies are trying to help the population recover. But some worry that proposed restrictions to protect the critical habitat of the endangered species may have actually backfired. With the one case on Kauai and the three dead seals here on Molokai, people are certainly starting to wonder. On this island, where the economy is depressed, many fishermen rely on the ocean to put food on the table. I don't like them. I don't like them. Monk seals are not welcome at these fish ponds just outside of Kanakakai. A community nonprofit spent $10,000 to stock two fish ponds it recently restored. Monk seals come in and they eat them. You know, uh, and you know, who gonna pay us back? You know, us guys are one nonprofit where we're suffering right now. Some fishermen say the seals will eat fish right off their lines and nets. Others worry about the competition for the long term. Uh, I understand they eat like up to 80 pounds of fish a day or more. But down the road, it could have a drastic impact on my fishery because all the fish that we catch, we let go. We're 100% catch and release. Some fishermen who walk miles to lay their nets know that they have to seek out areas where the seal hasn't already made its mark. If the monk seal is there, we have to move. We already know there's no fish. He made the, he went wild the fish, as they say. And they aren't surprised at the recent seal deaths. I wouldn't kill one. But I sure as heck will chase them away the best I can. You shouldn't be wasting things and just killing it for the sake of it or because you don't, um, you don't agree with um, the monk seal being here. But, I mean, if you're going to kill it, you should eat it. It's really disappointing. Anytime um, you're working with an endangered species, it, it's really disappointing to see someone take their anger out uh, on an animal in any way, shape, or form. Both state and federal agencies are looking at how best to work with the community and, if need be, identify the problem seals and relocate them. Catherine Cruz, KITV4 News. NOAA is expected to make a decision about the proposed habitat restrictions in June.